Hello, today we are looking at the song Pop Goes the Weasel. So here's your song Pop Goes the Weasel. Let me pull this in a little so we can see the music a little better. Uh, so Pop Goes the Weasel. I'm going to play Pop Goes the Weasel for you. So it starts off with the C chord, skip two, skip two white notes. And it's gonna, these are called staccato notes. So they're kind of, they they play down quickly, but they don't play close to each other necessarily. For the pop part, you're gonna take your left hand and I take two fingers of your left hand, maybe these two, and I'm gonna play any notes I want, any white, any white or black notes, up higher than the left hand, than the right hand. So up on this side. And then you gotta come back to where you know where you're at, skip two again, and the song finishes. I want you to especially notice that in a lot of the lines in Pop Goes the Weasel, especially at the end, or at the end, there's a C chord tied to another C chord. That does not, that second C chord does not play, which is why in my book it's crossed out. Here, this second C chord does not play either, which would be why it would be crossed out, or this one, or this one at the end. Staccato notes, and there's a little, uh, place in your book on page 12 that tells you that staccato notes have a dot underneath or on top and they're played short and separated. So I'm going to play that song for you one more time and you're going to try it. Have some fun. Bye-bye.